All right, Commissioner, you've been asked numerous times, if you were to put a number, Commissioner, on the number of times you've been asked about the media deal today, is it north of 100? By the way, it's north of whatever number you were going to throw out. <laughs> is it north yeah. of 1,000? Yeah. Um, fans will wonder why. So I've got to ask the question, yeah. why are we still here? I thought you gave a pretty good explanation downstairs uh, on that. pretty straightforward. Um, you know, media companies, technology companies have been going through kind of a difficult time the last nine months, and we're finding that the longer we wait, the better the deals get. So uh, the board has been very patient. That won't last forever. Right. Um, so we're trying to balance you know, the stability of the conference against uh, waiting and getting better deals. And I think we're at a place now where for the first time in a year, I've been willing to put a marker down in the stand and publicly say you know, that we're gonna do our media deals in the near future. I, I've not put a time frame on in the last year. It's, uh, I have John Wilner on every week. And John and I play this little game of chess every week. And he was so looking for it. I know you visited with him earlier today. He said he was going to see you. I think across the media landscape, it's like, well, what is the holdup? The fans are seeing it and hearing it from one space. So I do have to ask, is it really a holdup or is it just you saying, look, we don't have to put all of our cards on the table yet because media has changed dramatically in the last year. It, it has changed and it will continue to change. Yes. And that change is accelerating. And I think it's as simple as if we would have done a deal three or six or nine months ago, there would have been less bidders and the number would have been lower. So again, it's about being patient and getting the best deal we can. Expansion, contraction, all that stuff has been thrown out. You addressed it downstairs for the audience seeing this. Where would you say expansion is on the depth chart right now? Uh, so I think about it as a process and a procedure. We start with the media rights deal, get that done. Then the school signed the grant of rights. And then the third and next thing is considering expansion. We've done all of the work on expansion. We know who our targets are. We know why we're interested in them. We know what we would have to get from a media partner to add one school or a different school. And we'll make that decision. We've done all the pre-work. We'll make that decision after the grant of rights. So essentially, in grant of rights, fans may not know what that is about. If sure. you could give that in a nutshell. Yeah, um, after you do your media deal, you have to get the rights from the schools to aggregate them to sell to the media company. So each of the schools basically grants to the conference right. the right to aggregate and sell their rights. So for those of you saying, well, why don't they have all this done? He just laid it out there very succinctly that we have to get one, two, and three. The question is, when you get one, how much time does it take to get two and three done? Or yeah. do you think, Brad, so you, I can make this cake just no, like no, that? No, two, two, two uh, the grant of rights is actually a negotiated contract and we have negotiated that, it's done. The contract is ready to be signed. Okay. Um, there is a procedure that every school needs to go through after we uh, finish the media deals of getting the grant of rights approved. Some are public schools, some are private schools, there's right. different procedures. Two to three days to get that done. And then we've already done all the pre-work on expansion, so if we want to make a quick decision about that, that we could do immediately. So this could all come down in one fell swoop. You could call a press conference and say, here's item one, Here's two, here's three. Yeah, we. I think we would uh, announce it after all three were done. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah. No, 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 but, but, absolutely, but, absolutely. But uh, from the time that we've finalized the media deals to the time that we can announce it is less than a week. Yeah. Is it hard to get all this done given different, I don't even know the right way, because you alluded to it, there's different rules, different legalities in different states. In this, right? You have the yeah, but that um, that's just a process question. Just a process. Uh, okay. Who you have to go to to get approved the grant of rights, and most of our schools have done a lot of pre work on that mm -hmm. to shorten the time that that takes. You're bullish on where things are, no doubt. I mean, you, you really sound confident in yeah. getting all this done, and yeah. I, I think the the football side of it, you addressed it earlier today. We've had a lot of the athletes come through here. What is it about the conference this year that you're most looking forward to on the field? Well, I, I think it's the quarterbacks. Uh, we are going to be explosive offensive conference. You know, we have six quarterbacks returning to the conference who passed for 3,000 plus yards last year. Um, we set a record by having eight of them last year, six of them return this year. And, you know, we're, every one of our teams is going to score 30, 40 points a game. The question is who's going to play defense and who's going to win those games. Right. Appreciate you coming by. Thanks. Absolutely. Great to see you. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah.